Hey there, Marshmallow Box family. Welcome back to our channel. Today, we've got something truly thrilling and explosive to share with you all. We're diving deep into the world of science, history, and cinematic brilliance with the newly released movie that's taking the world by storm, Oppenheimer. Oppenheimer is an epic biographical thriller film written and directed by the legendary Christopher Nolan. Yes, the same visionary behind films like Inception and The Dark Knight trilogy. But this time, he's taking on a real life legend, J. Robert Oppenheimer, a theoretical physicist who played a pivotal role in developing the first nuclear weapons. The film is based on the captivating 2005 biography, American Prometheus, by Kai Bird and Martin J. Sherwin, and it stars some incredible talents. Leading the charge is J. Robert Oppenheimer himself is none other than the phenomenal Killian Murphy. And joining him are Emily Blunt as Oppenheimer's wife, Catherine Kitty Oppenheimer, Matt Damon as General Leslie Groves, the military handler, and the one and only Robert Downey Jr. As Louis Strauss, a senior member of the United States Atomic Energy Commission. And that's just the beginning. The supporting cast includes Florence Pugh, Josh Hartnett, Casey Affleck, Rami Malek, and Kenneth Branagh. Now, let me tell you about the production of Oppenheimer. Filming took place from February to May, combining the breathtaking IMAX 65mm and 65mm large format film. And here's a fascinating tidbit. For the first time, Nolan used sections in IMAX black and white analog photography. He's all about practical effects, so minimal computer-generated imagery was used, just like in his other brilliant works. But wait, there's more. Do you know how Oppenheimer even came into existence? The idea of adapting the biography, American Prometheus, had been floating around in Hollywood for years. Director Sam Mendes had shown interest, but the project remained stuck in development limbo. Then, during the production of Nolan's mind-bending film, Tenet, Robert Pattinson, one of the stars, gifted the director a book containing Oppenheimer's speeches. This gift ignited Nolan's curiosity and led him to explore the historical reality of Oppenheimer's life. What makes Oppenheimer even more extraordinary is Nolan's unique approach to storytelling. It's the first script written by Nolan in the first person, giving us an intimate and personal perspective of Jay. Robert Oppenheimer. Nolan masterfully uses color and black and white to create distinct timelines, blending the objective and subjective viewpoints. He doesn't shy away from exploring the complexities of Oppenheimer's life, including his affair with Jean Tatlock, a communist, and how it influenced his later fate. As we delve into the plot of Oppenheimer, we witness a young and brilliant Oppenheimer grappling with homesickness and anxiety at the Cavendish Laboratory. But fate intervenes when he stops Niels Bohr from unknowingly eating a poisoned apple. Oppenheimer's thirst for knowledge leads him back to the United States, where he dedicates his life to the development of nuclear weapons. But as World War II ends, the moral implications of their creation come to light, leading to devastating consequences. The wait for Oppenheimer was well worth it, as the film has taken the world by storm with its stunning visuals and Killian Murphy's tour de force performance as the titular character. Critics have unanimously praised the film, calling it a masterpiece and one of Nolan's best works. It's no surprise that Oppenheimer received a 93% positive score on Rotten Tomatoes and a Metacritic score of 90, indicating universal acclaim. Oppenheimer is not just a movie. It's an immersive experience that will leave you pondering the depths of history and the human condition. So, mark your calendars, grab your popcorn, and head to the theaters for a journey you won't forget. Thanks for joining me today, Marshmallow Box family. Stay curious, stay passionate, and keep exploring the captivating world of cinema. Don't forget to share your thoughts with us after watching the film. We can't wait to hear what you think. If you enjoyed this sneak peek into Oppenheimer, don't forget to hit that thumbs up button, subscribe to Marshmallow Box for more exciting updates, and be sure to turn on the notification bell so you won't miss any of our thrilling content. See you at the movies, Marshmallow Boxers. Goodbye.